Hi student, I'm t e s s e m Today topic is uh, muscular strength. I plan to, I was planning to study about muscular strength. But I want to just study with various topics from now. So, uh, because I think it will be fun. So, <laughs> today topic is how does myocardial cells conduct action potential? You know, action potential, right? Myocardial cells gather to organ we can call heart. So, today topic is how does heart conduct action potential? To study this, you must uh, um, first understand the i n t e r c a l l a t e disc. Myocardial cells are connected, right? The structure that connect um, between myocardial cells like this way is called an i n t e r c a l l a t e disc. Heart, myocardial cells, right? Heart is under very strong mechanical load, contraction and relaxation, right? and must be repeated uh, throughout whole life, right? So, this structure is very important keep to stabilize, right? So, desmosome, desmosome is a structure that mechanically connect myocardial cells between myocardial cells. It helps stabilize. i n t e r c a l l a t e disc has also gap junction. The gap junction is a pathway that conduct action potential between uh, myocardial cells. Very important structure, right? But there is no gap junction between the atrium and ventricle. In addition, atrium and ventricle are separated, right? By a fibrous, fibrous skeleton, fibrous structure, right? That is an electronic non-conductor. As you know, In order to contract the heart, the action potential of the atrium must be delivered to the ventricle, right? So, a special conduction system exists heart. Sinoatrial load, SA node, right? Atrioventricular node, AV node, right? And bundle of his and p a r k i n g e fiber. Through this special system, the action potential of the atrium can be conducted to the ventricle. Okay? Okay, I always on your side.